welcome to my second video where I'm going to be presenting how to make a great exhibition. Now before we get into that subject, I would just like to let you know that we're now accepting submissions at Axum Art Cafe's new art program. So this art program is a series of events in which you can take part. If you're an artist, if you're a musician, if you're a dancer or an actor, you can always send over your submissions with some pictures, with some videos, or maybe just a link and some description about your work so that we can actually take you into consideration. Now, how to make a great exhibition? Every exhibition has a message. Basically, an artist trying to convey a message to the public. You can already try to see which artist would be the best to participate in that message. Every exhibition has a name that goes along with it that is going to be easily understandable for marketing purposes. You have a title, now you need to look on a location. A location is basically a space where you're going to be exhibiting all of the artwork. So you need to see exactly what type of place you can afford and what would be the easiest option for you to hang your work in a very fashionable way. Keep in mind that if you're renting a place, you're going to have to give it back in the same um, state that you actually rented it in. So you don't want to make something that's going to be too complicated or pierce too many holes into the wall. I would say the best amount of time for an exhibition to last is two to three weeks. You want to stay open long enough because certain people won't buy the first night. How much work of art are you willing to exhibit? That is actually a liability because artwork is very, very valuable. So you don't want to have it in a place where it's not safe, where it can get damaged because you will be responsible for that. You don't want to have too much artwork because sometimes people can saturate. What I suggest you to do is to get 10 and 20 pieces of art where you're going to display them with enough space in between. Allow a certain purity so that you go from each artwork to each artwork and you're able to appreciate it directly for what it's truly worth. Put yourself in a visitor's shoes for one minute so that you can understand why am I going to go to this exhibition. The reason I'm doing this video because I understand that a lot of people can be making exhibition and a lot of people can be making money off of exhibition. There are a lot of artists but there are not enough curators. So I'm, I'm pushing a lot of young people to actually become curators so that we can stimulate the art industry a little bit more and allow new and up and come artists to get the platform that they deserve so that they can actually open doors for younger artists and so forth. Once again, thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe and see you guys next time for another cool vlog. Done.